This is the, like the shortest run I've done in a long time. Actually, no, I, I do want to make spell because um, I have the bishop, I have the cocoon and the bishops. Oh, new one. Let's identify those axes. No, it's cursed. Lots of cursed battle axes. Actually, go to the bar. Let's see if that quest is ready to turn in. I, I inadvertently did over the weekend. Uh, yep. Ah, so how'd you do? Did you advertise it all over? Oh, right. Give me back the sword. Here you go. You took the hound sword. All right, I'm going now. One of my plans as a, as a grand opening event for Helgamart. I'm going to sell this in an auction. Get a whopping bonus if I make a lot off of this. Later. Got a recovering vellum and 800 XP. All right, open the box for quests. Take a look at this one. Where does it? Walter's Quest.
Okay. Find me a certain book. You're the one who accepted the quest, right? A creepy man with a hood walked your way. How did you find a book that was hidden that was in the castle basement? I'm interested in what it says. His name was Walter Berry. He was an Imperial Scholar. He used to work with the Royal Family, but since the Flash, now he just deciphers ancient scriptures. Did you know? Two cities angered the gods and were destroyed long ago. I was deciphering a book written by a sorcerer from that city. There's something that bugs me. The two cities were wiped off the face of the Earth. The author must have escaped or somehow survived. Were there any survivors in the devastated city? Surprisingly, the author wrote that many people survived the Flash. Of course, it's contrary to other written history. The two cities became a wasteland where even grass wouldn't grow. Many historians and adventurers have added to that testimony. But who's the author? Where did the book come from? Walter looked away fearfully. Sadly, that Flash has hit us as well. I thought the truth was lost forever. An adventure bro Adventurer brought back a book from the labyrinth that was from the castle. Maybe that not all was lost. There may, st may still be some books left in the labyrinth. I want you to find the Book of Festivals. The cover has two adjoining triangles engraved on it. I'm counting on you. Okay. Cold wind bl the cold wind blows through the ruins of Duhan. There are several young men braving the cold moving forward. While you're watching them, a piece of play paper comes flying at you. They scribbled on it. Revolutionary new weapon shop, Helgamart, now open on the first floor of the labyrinth. So, best grand opening event, special auction. Now's your chance to get the one and only Helga Brand Hound Sword. Don't miss out. Miss out. Vellum, but that's okay. Okay, what is new spell? I think it was the same. I think it was just the one I already gotten as the recovering. Oh well, that's fine. Let's stop by Helga's and see what she's got. It might be <coughs> even locked another shop, so.
100 G, <coughs> 100 G, 300 G, hmm, 1000 G, what the, 1500 G. The men are caught were setting their bids across the room with powerful voices. They're in the midst of an option celebrating the grand opening of Helgamart. Oh, welcome, you came just at the right time, right over here. You were led forcibly to harm the crowd of people. You were standing at the front of the crowd by the time you realized it. Everyone, stop! We have a special guest for you tonight. You just is scheduled just to be here. He is the legendary adventurer who first used the the Hound Sword in space. In space. Helga? What are you doing? Let me introduce Durgan. I should like... I should like lose the possibility to get all of these possible party members because of this. Hey, you're the... I'm glad we can meet again. I've been looking for a distinguished adventurer like yourself. Why don't you be kind of to trade with me for my staff? I'll be doing the damn auction for your friggin' sword. Will you sign it for me afterwards, dude? What the? Don't you dare talk to Durgan like that. Shut up. Your old, your old ass needs to just stay out of this. Hey, be, be nice. Be nice to the, the other people in the auction. I never give a sword an old geezer warrior like you use. It would make not a difference. Now, now, young one. I don't think you should insult your elders. You shut your mouth. You're older. Wow. Body mouth. Shut your mouth. Your older ass needs to stay even further back. Hmm. Kids these days are just ignorant. Hey, you're swinging. Sword swinging monkey? What the heck did you just say? I said, kids these days are ignorant. Am I mistaken? Oh god, we're going to have a fight. What? You a hole? Are you trying to start something? Hey, hold it! Don't you dare fight in my store! This is between me and the puck. You need to butt into this. Yeah, if you're gonna whoop this puck's ass, let me join you! Me too! Hmm, why don't you just try? All of you, bring it! Stop it! Shut up! Yep, we're gonna have a fight. Se several hours later. But we got in the room when the guests weren't out of control, the fight wound up outside. Helga tried to stop the fight, but in the process, she's got badly hurt. Oh, oh, ow! I have to end up getting hurt. I'm not gonna give those guys. I'm gonna sue somebody. Ouch! I can't even think straight. Oh, do you have a dragon heart by chance? If you do, may I have one? A dragon heart. Unfortunately, you could shook your head. You just couldn't find one. Oh darn! You don't have any, huh? That's okay. Let's go out and buy one. Laters. Get up the room dragging your wounded leg. Oh. sign over here. On the sign, in barely legible handwriting, it read, If you're turning to stone, use the will spell. If you don't have the curing potion, there is, if you don't have it, use a curing potion. If there isn't one, go to the temple later. Mighty Warrior Odom. Good to know. Oh, 
Oh, shoot. Okay, I think in the back right, two guys in the front. Okay. Uh... You guys are vulnerable to the magic. a lot of hit points. Uh, another version of the same fight. Okay. Okay. Uh, more of the damn spiders. Okay. Defensive action, front guard, and put poison. Um. Defensive action, strict shot, you two. Back to them. And then, yet again, we are. In, actually, no, let's. Special action, you are going to spell the white corpses. Back at the spider, and he's gonna cast heal again. 
Oh, I'm just fired. Oh, you can cast spells? Okay. That's a pain in my butt. Uh... Keep doing the front guard. Deploy the second action. And then spell, free spell. Need to heal the back row, fortunately. Actually, I think your bow counts as magic. Next time you I don't have you cast. Good, <sighs> got okay, the healing done. Okay, got back. Get all the spells out right away. Okay. I'm sick of these mother freaking spiders in my mother freaking dungeon. I feel like combine front guard with deploy. See if that will reduce the damage while mitigating the poison. Nobody's getting hit with the poison status effect, so that's good.
Thanks for taking a lot of damage. Same thing. Okay, good. Actually, party members, that's two party members leveled up. We're bailing again. Uh, we are, this is probably the quickest turnaround we've been doing for, uh, spells here. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, please like and subscribe. And also consider backing my Patreon. Patreon backers get episodes up to one week early of this show and any f future Let's Plays. Also, please consider backing my coffee. Uh, toss me a few bucks, also helps support the show, and it's not a monthly obligation or anything like that.